and you bump into places you don't expect. Tourists from Amsterdam take in the unusual display at the Lattice Gallery on Northwest Broadway. I'm from Europe and we're into soccer. These are soccer balls. That's how it looked to me. What's behind it? Who's the, who's the fellow behind it? That fellow is Sam Lanahan, once in the computer software business, now dreaming big about construction. It turns out that the Bucky ball or the soccer ball shape, which is comprised of 12 pentagons and 20 hexagons, is ideally suited for carrying uh, compressional loads. Combine that compression with tension, and Sam believes you can build almost anything. I'd like to start building bridges. I'd like to start building uh, sidewalks. I saw you walk on it, though. What did it feel like when you walked on it? It's very flexible. Uh, it looks like a, a trampoline. <laughs> Feels like a trampoline. Jokingly, if you will, it's a roof replacement for Notre Dame. That might take some divine intervention. <laughs> well, <saying>. but <laughs> we, should th we should be thinking that large. He's been thinking large about what he calls flextegrity for 15 years, producing his soccer ball shapes in plastic, steel, aluminum, and biodegradable material. It makes perfect sense, but how do you convince people? It's going to be resilient against earthquake because the tension is going to dissipate the energy of the earthquake. Sam's taken his idea to numerous trade shows and spent money on elaborate marketing videos. So somebody came up with an idea, why don't we have a girl you know, twist in, in underneath this thing? <laughs> and you did it. And we did it. But Sam admits it's been a challenge to get his idea to the next level. For now, he shares it with visitors to his lattice gallery each first Thursday of the month. This is what I wake up in the morning thinking about. And so have I already thought about the next design? Yes. So when you go home, you're going to be talking about the guy you met in Portland, the genius, right? If I don't drink too much beer tonight. <laughs> no, probably. It starts with small ideas, and it's, you, never, you never know how it works out.